A super long time like a year? No, like a million years? Look, this fossil is a tooth. Look, in the rock, a leaf. A shell. But that's not all. A fossil can be something that a living creature left behind. It's called a trace fossil. Take a look. That's a footprint from a dinosaur. And not just any dinosaur. <gasps> a Tyrannosaurus Rex. T-Rex for short. Yay! Dino, dino, dino! So let's go find some fossils. Dino, roar! 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 Whoa! Roar! Roar! Nash makes a pretty good dinosaur. I think he's being a T-Rex. Maybe we should call him a Nashosaurus Rex. <laughs> <laughs> well, all the dinosaurs were pretty cool, my favorite is a T-Rex. I know. Totally. It was 20 feet tall. That's as tall as two elephants on top of each other. Whoa, giant! It had an enormous head, almost as big as a person with 52 60 teeth. But it had little tiny arms and big legs and a long tail. Scientists think the T-Rex ate other dinosaurs. Rawr! 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 Like this one. Whoa, again! That's a big dinosaur. The T-Rex was one of the most amazing predators ever. Do scientists know all this about the T-Rex from fossils? Mm-hmm. Yep. So let's try to find some. Remember, lots of things can be fossils. So keep your eyes peeled. If only I can figure out what to do. Hmm. Hi, Willow. Hi. What are you making? It's a sculpture. <gasps> it's a frog. Yeah, a poison dart frog. They're my favorite rainforest animal. So what are you doing for the Rainforest Art Show? Not sure yet. I'm still working on it. <sighs> <laughs> now that's a strange bush. <laughs> Nash? Hello! A leaf costume! <laughs> what a good idea! <sighs> but what am I going to do? <gasps> Gorby, did you hear that? There's a monkey around here somewhere. <laughs> Not a real monkey. I'm making an animated monkey for the Rainforest Art Show. But it's not finished. Aww. I don't know which one to choose. I like this picture and also this one. Oh! What's wrong, Chester? I can't decide which one to use for the Rainforest Art Show. Hmm. They all look good to me. Lily, you're right. I'll use all my photos. Thanks. Happy to help. Now if I could just figure out what to do for the show. Everyone else's art is so cool. But I still don't know what kind of art to do for the show. <laughs> Loud. Wow, that bird is dancing. Wait, that's it. I'll do a dance for the show. Hey, Chester, I just saw the most amazing thing a dancing bird. I'm putting in Rainforest Dancing Bird. That one! The superb bird of paradise. Whoa! So the male bird makes a dance floor by sweeping away dirt and branches. And then it calls to the females. I heard it. It was loud. And when they come, it goes into its dance. They snap their tail feathers. It sounded like snapping fingers. Hey, I think I found something. <gasps> what is it? 
it? I don't know. Hmm. It's kind of pointy. Let's be careful. We don't want to break it. Dino! 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 Rawr! Huh? <gasps> curvy and very, very sharp. Hmm? Oh! This is it! Whoa! It's a claw! A dinosaur claw? Hmm, I don't know. How can dinosaur scientists tell what the bones are? Scientists who study fossils are called Paleontologists. They compare new finds against things they already have. And against creatures that are alive today that have similar skeletons, like lizards or birds. But I can use my fossil tracker. Tyrannosaurus Rex Claw. Whoa! A T-Rex Claw! We found a fossil! Wait, oh, yeah. Yeah. <gasps> hey, where's Nash? Nash! Holy guacamole! A whole T-Rex skeleton! Dino, dino, dino! But it's missing one thing. A, a claw! claw. Okay, Chester, I got it. Don't worry, Marco, I got it. Whoa! Teddy! Mm-mm. Bouncy ball! Teddy. Bouncy ball? Aww. We'll never get our stuff back into the Polomobile. Oh, ants! Let me get this out of your way. Oh, and this. Oh, ah! Check out all the ants. Hey. Wow. Oh, lucky. They're carrying something. Yeah, it looks like little bits of leaves. Where do you think they're going? Let's follow them and find out. Look at that. This must be where the ants live. When ants work and live together, it's called a colony. I wonder what kind of ants these are. Oh, look it up. Looks like they're leaf cutter ants. There are leaf cutter ants all over the rainforest. So they cut up leaves and bring them back to the colony to eat? Actually, no. They chew up the leaves and they're turning them into goo. So they eat the goo? This is the amazing part. Another living thing called fungus grows its spores on the goo as it decays. The ants eat the fungus that grows from the spores. Unbelievable! They cut up the leaves to feed the fungus, and then they eat the fungus. These ants are fungus farmers. Wow, there are so many of them. It says there can be eight million ants in a colony. That's a lot of leaves to cut, goo to chew, and fungus to farm to feed everybody. They must have to be really well organized to get everything done. Wow, look at that! Now that's a rainforest dance. 
Welcome to the Rainforest Art Show. Hi! Foggy! Please! Now, Lily! Step to the left, bounce to the right Strut like a bird of paradise Sway like a palm tree in the breeze To the rainforest dance with me Step to the left, bounce right, hooray! When the music plays Sway like a palm tree in the breeze To the rainforest dance with me